Hey, what's going on everyone? Nick Sapinero here once again from the Divi offices to give you your weekly development update. So this was a pretty productive week. We're pretty much feature complete on the blockchain at this point. We're going into beta testing for the code complete version, uh, which will hopefully become the release candidate for the core. The desktop app has three open tasks at the moment, and one of which is the Mochi. Once those are closed, we'll be feature complete on desktop, and we've actually overhauled the entire UI. I'm gonna have Frisco put a screenshot of that up here right now. Um, as you'll see, we've made quite a few improvements to the overall interface. We do have some updated information on some of the features, uh, especially surrounding governance in our blockchain. We've finished coding uh, what we call a DVS, or the dynamic value sporks, which allow for dynamic changes in the blockchain based on governance votes and proposals. Uh, this basically affects you guys because you'll be able to vote on things like um, inflation and things like that and automatically change them based on consensus. So it's a really unique feature that we're very proud of and we're excited to show you guys in the near future. Uh, we've also updated some of the details about lottery blocks and coin stake age which you can find blogs on uh, on our blog and we'll leave links in the description of this video as well. So the last thing I want to ask you guys to do is head over to our forum at forum.diviproject.org and join the discussion about how Divi could possibly be used in healthcare. We're having an interesting discussion there already and we hope to see you over there. The link, once again, is in the description. As always, you can find us on social media. Come join us on Telegram or Discord if you want to chat directly with us and we'll see you in the next update.